what's up youtube it's your boy invade and we are back with another video this video is a video that i promised a lot of my twitter community mixer community even twitch community i was supposed to do probably about two and a half maybe three weeks ago um and it's basically why i've decided to return to mixer um so without further ado let's get into the video Yee! All right, so to keep this video short and sweet, there isn't a lot of big reasons why. Um, to get into it, everybody knows that I left Mixer and, and I went to Twitch and I made a whole video about it. And some people agreed with it, some people didn't. Again, it's my life, so at that point, it's all about you know what I want to do and what I feel is best for me. Um, and just to kind of clarify things, the reason why I decided to do it was because of those reasons that I said in the video, but also because I'm a big, big proponent and champion of doing or not having any regrets um in your future or in your your life right so i felt like me being on twitch for even a month which is how long that i was on twitch for a month um was big for me because it was it was not a what if moment that i was gonna have in the future and although um i i did like it there it's just it just doesn't compare to mixer because of maybe and maybe that's just because of how long I was there or maybe that's because of the community or maybe that's because of the family that I that I have on Mixer I don't know but I missed the Mixer in general um a lot of people thought that I came back because oh he must have been failing oh he didn't have a lot of his viewers there so he came back because he wasn't successful and yada 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 um and I could literally show y'all the numbers if I wanted to but I had my highest sub count that I ever had um on Twitch I had my highest view count that I ever had on Twitch um, I had gotten hosted by multiple interview uh, individuals. I had Red Bull come in. Red Bull freaking gaming came in and hosted me and gifted me some subs. I had a lot of things happen that went the right way. I had an opportunity to be on a show from Twitch that got a message that was gonna that was gonna show upcoming streamers and show the grind. I had a lot of stuff, a lot of things lined up that I had an opportunity to be on. Um, that that I could have never guessed what happened. And maybe that's because I'm just blessed and God is always looking out for me. I don't know what that case may be, but I had a lot of opportunities arise for me on there and a lot of good things happen. But even with all those good things, it doesn't compare to me. In my opinion, it does not compare to me or compare to how good I felt on Mixer. It doesn't compare to being able to talk to your community immediately. It doesn't compare to being able to sit there and, and laugh all day because it really is a true family. You don't have that when you start over on Twitch. You don't. You have some of your community come over. You have um, them, those people hang out, but then you have to start building all that over again. Then you have to start figuring out, okay, who are the people that I can trust on Twitch? Who are the people that I can talk to? Who are the people? And I already had all of that over on Mixer. Um, so I missed all of that, man. Um, and I missed being able to, to have, you know, a partner manager. I know that sounds crazy, but I miss, cause we, I guess we kind of take them for granted. I miss my partner manager. For those of you who don't know who my partner manager is, she's Callie Shane. She's great. She's amazing. And I appreciate everything that she's done for me. She's always been nice about handling things for me. And I'm showing great love to you because I, again, I do appreciate it. Um, but I missed all of that. I miss having somebody that I could voice my opinions to without having any issues. And, and, and that was a big reason why I wanted to come back. I wanted to come back to be able to really extend my community. I wanted to come back and really be able to say hey to everybody. I wanted to come back and talk to all my friends again because it felt like home. And I know a lot of people say you need to be comfortable being uncomfortable. And I was, I was okay with Twitch, but at the end of the day, it's just not what it was for me. Mixer is my home and that's generally it. Um, am I doing better than I was on Twitch? no i'm not um does that bother me no will we get there one day i hope so um but that's a decision that i'm deciding to make and i'm cool with it um but at the end of the day that's the reason why i decided to come back i, I literally just enjoy my community i miss all my friends um and i miss being able to talk and have like that 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 side angle for lack of better words to, to voice my opinion on certain things or voice my issues which with twitch being so massive you just don't have that whether you're a partner or not it's gonna take them 10 years to respond. Um, and it is what it is. That's just how it is. They're massive. But that's the reason why I decided to come back. I hope that makes sense to y'all. Um that's that's yeah, like I said, that's pretty much it. It wasn't because I was failing, it wasn't because I wasn't being successful. Like I said, I had a lot of opportunities that arise that I could have never thought would have happened again. 
I thank God for all of those because it seems like wherever I go, there's always favor that's that's put on me. Um, and I'm always blessed wherever I go. So um, from that standpoint, yeah, it wasn't because I was failing or anything like that. Me and my girlfriend talked and honestly, we, we just miss Mix. So we mix all our friends. And from the first stream to where we are now, I've played every game that I could possibly play from 2K to Smite to Valorant to Call of Duty Warzone to a little bit of Fortnite. And I say little because it is little, little bit of Fortnite. So literally whatever it, I could play. Um, and honestly, like I've probably seen even a bigger increase, which is one of my bigger complaints than I had back then was that it feels like you can't play whatever game you wanted to play. And now it feels like to a degree, especially now that, you know, wherever I go, I've been averaging close to 100, 150 viewers, no matter what game that I've been playing. So um yeah that's my reason why i hope you guys understand it um i hope you guys respect it and um outside of that i'll see you guys in the next video also um uh, for those of you who don't know now my 2k community and whoever else is watching you can find me on mixer.com slash invade see you guys in the next video peace